What's up guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to use cheat codes with the RetroArch systems and that's going to be your Nintendo, Super Nintendo, uh, Sega Genesis, etc. It's real easy to do, so all you need is a keyboard and you're going to want to press the tab key on the keyboard to start. Then that's going to bring you to this screen. You can just hit enter on that quick menu there. And then you want to hit the down arrow key and hit enter on cheats and then go to load cheat file. Here you're going to look for the system that you want to use, so I'm going to do Super Nintendo. And you can select from Game Genie or Pro Action Replay, so I'm going to do the first one. And right now you can look for the game that you're playing. I'm doing the right arrow key right now, which kind of skips you through. You can also do the down arrow key. Okay, so here's Super Mario World, so you want to press enter on that one. And that's going to bring you back to this screen. Now on this screen, you want to scroll down and that's going to actually show you all of the cheats. So for this example, let's start with 99 lives. So select that and hit the right arrow key. You're going to see that it turns on and on the bottom left there, you get some yellow text. And then you want to go up and hit enter on apply cheat changes. Then you're going to press the back key on the keyboard and you're going to go up to resume. All right, so let's try this. All right, and you can see that I have X99 for 99 lives. And let's go into the game. Let's go into this level here. And I'm going to show you guys another cheat just for, as another example. So hit the tab key. At this point, it will already bring you back to the quick menu since you already selected it before. So I'm just going to go down to cheats. And the cheat files will already be loaded again because you already selected them before. So let's try... Let's try start and stay invisible. So right arrow key to turn that on. And then I'm going to go up and do apply and enter on that. Then the back key, go back up and resume. And now you can see that I have invisibility turned on. Now I've noticed sometimes when you do the cheats, they don't take. So what I do in that case is after I go to cheats and, you know, I select the cheat and turn it on and I do apply cheat, I'll go back again, and then I'll do restart, and then I'll go up to resume, and then resume. And that seems to uh, fix the problem. But normally they do work fine, but if, if you do the cheat and it doesn't take, just do restart, then resume, and that'll take care of it for you. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one.